I'm Norm Rich, I teach uh, AP Psychology and Regular Psychology, um, and I've been here at Ulta for 21 years. Yeah, I'll tell you, Connor, I think what makes our service so special is the fact that we have all these different traditions we've been doing. You know, you think about the turkey drive, where we have given hundreds of turkeys, thousands of canned goods for over 50 years. You think about the giving tree, which has gone on for 36 years, giving 500 gifts uh, to families. Uh, you think about our Sotho uh, food packing project for the last decade, packing over 20,000 meals a year. Uh, the pajama thing and all the other little things we do and when you put all that together it is immense it's a lot and it really shows the i think the faith and the willingness of this community to give of their money and their time and their talent yeah so i uh you know connor i think any time that we deal with people, especially when we go out and we reach out to people that we don't know, that are strangers, I think we come face to face with God in a lot of ways. But I remember in some ways what students taught me. So a few years ago, we had this lady, she was blind, had no family. And so I had a few men, uh, me and Mr. Ruff, a couple men went and helped her move during the morning uh, from her old place to this new apartment. And anyway, at the end, and she was just thrilled, these young men coming in, helping her and doing all this for her. And it wasn't easy work. But at the very end, one of our students kind of taught us a lesson. At the very end, he asked this lady, would you like us to pray with you? And I was blown away. I mean, I was ready to leave and they were like, would you like us to pray with you? And this lady just lit up and it was real clear. She had all kinds of, I think, uh, family issues, all kinds of struggles in her life. And that meant so much to her, and it blew me away. And I thought I learned an important lesson that day about faith. You know, not always to keep our faith hidden, but to let it be out there. So not only do I think our students grow, but I've grown a lot from watching them. Again, I think one of the greatest ways that we come to know God is through other people. And uh, I've certainly got to meet a lot of neat people in the community, but I also have loved to watch our kids grow in their faith by going out and serving other people. And, you know, I, I remember one time somebody asked me why I believed in God. And instead of using all these great arguments, I just kind of blurted out because of love. And I think we go out and we serve other people. Um, we come to experience love. And in experiencing love, we come to know God more. And I've seen that in a lot of our students, you know, who faith in the classroom, they may not be able to grab it intellectually, but when they go out and they experience God through the love of other people, they're able to come more deeply to their own faith.